Hey, I'm Jess Leahy, and welcome back to the Addiction Inoculation in my office, in which we speak privately about preventing substance use in kids. Last time we talked about the great news that over the past decade, drug and alcohol use has been on a nice, even decline, little plateaus here and there. But generally speaking, we're back to pre-pandemic levels. Yay! But let's talk about the exceptions. Nicotine vaping is up uh, almost three times what it was uh, when we first started watching this in 2017. We're up to about 16% of adolescents report having used nicotine vape in the past year, as opposed to 6% in 2017. Pot and hallucinogens. Pot and hallucinogens are up among 19 to 30 year olds. And often where 19 to 30 year olds go, adolescents go. So we're gonna keep an eye on this, okay? Hallucinogens, um, there is a shift, a cultural shift in attitudes towards hallucinogens, which I think is great because they um, definitely are looking promising in the research around use for end of life care and uh, PTSD and intract intractable uh, depression and possibly even substance use disorder. Um, so let's keep an eye on that. In terms of weed, you know, I think that legalization and the novelty bump has a lot to do with that. Um, I'm not, the numbers aren't hugely high right now, but they are um, up slightly. So let's keep an eye on that one. 